students. So where are you improving? What is the point of giving mock test when you are not able to remember the mistake which you made so that you can avoid in the actual exam? So let me tell you what I have read uh, the theory, but they have not practiced enough questions. But when they make mistakes in those questions and after doing the mock test, they think, oh my God, I could have done this question, but you could not do in actual mock test. A lot of people asked me, Bhaiya, I'm not able to improve my marks in the mock test. Even some people are getting much lesser mark. Their, their performance is decreasing in the mock test. The reason is, number one, you guys are not analyzing your mistakes properly. And number two, when you analyze your mistakes, what you guys do is, solution is already there. We give you the solutions, right? Solution is already there, so you just see the solutions. Now, when you made a mistake, you just saw the solution. Next day, you'll forget it. Next day, you'll forget it. If not next day, you'll definitely forget it in next week, right? By the time exam comes. So where are you improving? What is the point of giving mock test when you're not able to remember the mistake which you made so that you can avoid in the actual exam? So let me tell you what to do in that case. Number one, analyze your mistakes properly. Do not give the conceptual problem as silly mistakes. A lot of people, you know, they are, their concept is not so strong. They have read, read the theory. They have read uh, the theory, but they have not practiced enough questions. But when they make mistakes in those questions and after doing the mock test, they think, oh my God, I could have done this question, but you could not do in actual mock test. The reason is that you think it is a silly mistake, but it is not. It is your conceptual problem. So practice that particular topic. Okay, so I have already told a lot of time when you solve questions, question to theory approach. When you solve questions, you're able to do good, fine. If you're not able to do that question, just see where is the mistake you're making. Now, you analyze where is the mistake you're making, attempt it again after the mock test is done. Just attempt by yourself. Don't see the solution. Don't see the solution if at least attempt for three times. Let me, I'm just requesting you all, don't see the solution even if you have even after you know that you're not able to do a particular question. When you're not able to do a particular question, try it at least three more times. I'm just requesting you, begging you, so that you will remember on the day of actual exam. Don't see the solution immediately. When you're not able to do a question, try it three more times. Just read theory, read uh, whatever materials you have, revise the concept, come back and solve it again. You're not able to do it, go read theory and do the question again. At least three times, after that, you see the th uh, answer given to you, the solution of the mock test given to you. And then you will be able to remember. You will be like, oh my God, what the hell? And after you see the solution, you will realize, oh shit, man. Like you tried at least four or five times, right? And when you will realize, okay, this was the mistake you were making, you will not forget even for one month. And that is what you need. So even if you are just improving on one concept every day, like this one particular concept question you are not able to do and you know that this is an important concept right because in our mock test we give important concepts only we do not give uh, non-important concepts so you know that this concept is important don't see the solution try it three four times at least then when you see the solution you will remember it that can really boost your marks and rank at least you will avoid the negative marking a lot of you do negative marking as a result you get 50 marks but you get minus 10 or minus 20 so you get total 30 marks for example so a lot of you have this problem of negative marking because you're not learning from your previous mock test so this is why you're not improving in the mock test in mock test one you made the mistake when you made the mistake you just saw the solution and you saw okay here is the mistake i'm making in next mock but you didn't remember it right in next mock test again you made mistakes you also made the mistake which you have already repeated Okay, so you're just repeating the same mistake in the consequent mock test. So how will you improve? Just ask yourself. So please remember this. Don't see the solution directly. At least try three times. Koi bhi sapna saakar karne ke liye sabse zaruri hai sahi coach ka hona. Chuniye Sai Astra aur kare apne IAT and NEST ka sapna saakar. Download the app now.